Welcome back to Vic v &E. What a beautiful Sunday afternoon, well, yeah, afternoon, I guess. It's a little after 12. But, you know, it's one of them things. We're out on two wheels. Nice breeze on the bike, I'll give it that. It'll probably be a I say about 65 degrees at the moment. Oh man. Nice to be out on the bike. Oh, I just need an open road and go for it, you know. Oh, what's been going on? Not a whole lot lately, really. You know, picked up a new PlayStation 4 since last time we were out. I think one way. Oh, goddamn, I bet it's been about a month since I last did a video. End of February, I think, when I picked up the new battery for the bike. Well, had no problem starting the old girl, you know, fired up straight away. What the hell's going on here? Well, it's that season again, you know, tractors are out. Farmers doing the shit, you know, as they always do. Oh, come on. They're fixing to start tearing this road up, redoing it. Should be any time, they started putting the signs out and that. Get in before the car comes. Yeah. Anyway, where were I? Oh yeah, I picked up a new PlayStation 4 Slim, you know. Started playing online on the Grand Theft Auto again. Fucking hell, it's like an addiction. You start in it and start getting around the world, you know, fucking San Andreas and that. Or whatever it's called. Fuck me. Fucking. I gotta fucking remember the whole fucking map. You know, remember where fucking shit is again. It's been a long time. Too long, really, but fuck me. Fucking late at night, you know, playing on there online, Reed Spud and his rubber and that, you know. Hell, well, fucking, I'm having to start from scratch, fucking build me RP points up and all that, what? You know, fuck. Just now managed to get a decent sniper rifle scope. Fuck, I'm the wrong way for Jiffy fucking getting the decent rifle that I need. It's fucking. I think you gotta be about fucking 90 RP to get that. No, the one I've got now fucking takes too long to reload and that. Fuck me. Well, you know, it's all part of parcel of the game, you know, going in there, getting missions done, building me RP up and all that, you know, so I can get further and further into it. Like I said, I'm just starting out again, fucking first scratch from fucking nothing, really. Got my motorcycle clubhouse the other day. And bought me an apartment, you know, two car garage sort of thing. Just so I can start spawning in one spot all the time and fucking not have it bouncing me round here, there, and fucking everywhere. Hell, it fucking put you in the middle of the desert every time you fucking come to it. Got a real fair fucking mile before you get to the highway. Not anymore, now I've got my two car garage, I'll spawn there all the time and fucking I've got a car fucking straight away when I get in the game. I've got to buy a bike yet for the motorcycle club. Fuck it, I've got the motorcycle club, I just ain't bought any bikes for it yet. Like I say, it's all in good time, got to get fucking helicopter and all that first, stop blowing shit up. Good for taking your fucking aggression out on fucking shit. I've played the story mode on it before, but I never really got into the online game playing on it until now. It is what it is. Oh. I hope you can feel 
Mont Gris. Feels fucking good out here on the bottom. doing 70 on a fucking 55 mile an hour road. Just fucking feeling of it being out on the back again. It's fucking great. Nice blue grips, you know, fucking match the paintwork on the back even though it is dirty. Like I say, I'm going to get around to painting it, but no, I'm going to fucking have time to do it. Ripping all the fucking paint off and tearing it all apart just to do it, you know. Fucking I ain't got time for that really. Winter time I thought I'd be able to do it and fuck, oh, it's too cold, couldn't fucking do it. So basically just put it all back together and you know, here we are, fucking riding around, fucking. Now we got decent weather, fuck, oh, I don't feel like fucking painting it now. Got new regulator rectifier on the old girl. There you go. Anything needed to fucking keep her on the go is going. We're supposed to take it for an inspection Friday. Because fucking everyone, you know, motorcycle tags are now April. Which I've got to the end of this month to get it done, but you know, they're not rush. It's just, I only have a narrow window to fucking do it. Because if I don't get home on a Thursday, my, you know, usual plan is to try and get in on a Thursday. If I get in on a Friday or something, I won't be able to get it inspected. So I've got to fucking get it done on a Friday when I get in. I got fucking lazy this week, fucking didn't do it. I had all intentions of getting it done, right, you know, fucking Friday, but... I just, I don't know, you, you, you ever get that feeling, you just know, nah, it's not a good day to be going out on the bike, so, you know, that's what I had Friday, and, uh, whether it was right or wrong, I don't know, you know, fucking anything could have happened, really, but someone was just telling me, fucking, I don't know, like, guardian angel sort of thing, you know, you don't need to be riding your bike today, so, you know, fucking, I ended up fucking not doing it. Here we are, you know, fucking nice Sunday, fucking out on the bike, fucking throwing a video together, one way over and over. Just basically running my mouth about nothing, really, you know, fucking Chris is doing okay with the leukemia, the medication's working and all that lot, you know. Well, it's all we can expect, you know, really, because you can't cure that shit, you know, it's uncurable, the chronic fucking, whatever, CML. Leukemia, the front one she's got, you know, they can suppress it, but they can't cure it, so... Everything's going well on that part, like, you know, it's all suppressed, the white blood cell count's doing good. Fucking fighting with the insurance companies, because they want her to have the generic drug. Which goes, fucking well, fair enough, you know, you know, if you're paying for this shit, they'll take the generic. Three months later they're complaining, hey we can't be paying for this drug, it's costing too much basically, you know, but you need to find other ways of treat treatment. What the hell? You know, you're the one who fucking wanted to pay for that fucking drug, so we had it changed to that fucking drug. <laughs> so now they're paying they agreed to pay for the generic kind. Which is, which is all well and good, you know, it's fucking does the same job. But my part of it is um, they were the ones that wanted to have the fucking name brand fucking shit. Fucking, we were on the generic to start with. Fucking bunch of idiots. Fuck oh, me. Fucking insurance companies have fucking lost their fucking minds. Dumb. 